Hello and welcome again to this is 42. 40 freaking 2 of the Outer Worlds. Last time we uh, busted in the fucking Chairman Rockwell's fucking office and we read his documents and <laughs> that's really it. We also, I guess, terrorized the citizens of Byzantium just a little bit more, which is always fun. Uh, now we're going to go get ourselves some uh, chemicals. Like, we're, we're, there's not much else we're doing. It is, it is the main quest. We have done all the cool, interesting side quests. We are working towards finishing this game. I'm, I'm really hoping we, I can just be done with this. <laughs> not that I, I, I mean, I will be sad that it'll be over soon. See, it feels like there's one guy that really wants to fuck with me, but... Like, I can see some red triangles. Oh, all the red triangles are all just you guys. Okay. Okay, I see how it is. I know I know when I'm not wanted. Despite my endless up to, uh, uploads to the YouTube uh, internet website. Ha <laughs> ha! That was a, a, a self-deprecating joke. Uh... You know what? I feel like I should give myself a little bit more respect for for doing something that I enjoy on the side as a hobby. <laughs> How dare I? Hope you guys don't mind if I just walk into your place of uh, work, do you? Or to yours today. Each of your companion has a unique uh, perk and unique special attack. I have never used it. Oh, 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 jeez. Just stand still. Stands barred. Uh, I don't. There isn't really a subtle way to go. Go through with this. Yeah, oh geez, there's civilians in the mix too again. Oh. Felix, you're fucking hurting civilians. Stop using your fucking grenade launchers when the clerks are around. Jeez. Guys, it's okay. I'm not here to hurt you. I'm here to hurt everybody with armor on. <laughs> Guys, relax. It's fine. Everything's gonna be just fine. Are you a higher up at this business? No, I'm, then I'm not gonna hurt you. I will. Everybody leave. I'm I'm the I'm the nicest armed assailant you'll ever meet. A lot of cool posters in here. Well, I guess this, this is the propaganda office, right? Morale and accuracy. So, uh, yeah, that's just propaganda. And this is just a bathroom. Where am I going? Where the fuck am I? I'm supposed to go like down, right? Where's my green arrow? Yeah, it's just 52 meters that way. Should be fine. Yeah, get back to work, you guys. Everything's fine. You got... Okay, well... Looks... I'm just gonna have to fucking shoot everybody here, don't I? Whoa, oh my god, your fucking friends are dying and shit. Oh, fuck, I missed. I don't like that I can't be creative about this. <laughs> I was hoping to maybe sneak around or something. I like I, I do remember distinctly in, an, in another playthrough of this game just sneaking around and, and not killing anybody. But I, the whole point of playing as Janine McSpacer was to try and like not kill too many people. You know, just being a regular person from a farm back home. You know, believes in self-defense, but does not believe in just, you know, uh, killing people. Like, I, I wanted to make an effort to mitigate as much violence as I could, but this has been, like, an incredibly violent playthrough. And it's, it, it is not by choice. Well, well I guess it's a, a, a product of the choices I have made. So, and maybe in that respect, this was my choice, but... This isn't what I wanted to result at, uh, from my choices. 
far? Okay, how the fuck do I get down there? Am I going the wrong way? I think I'm gonna start taking my lunches out in the city. That woman from downstairs is still in the cafeteria. That scientist? The one who's been hounding the clerks? Ooh, gives me the shudders, too. So that's the talk. That's the talk of the day. I'm, I'm, I'm literally in your building shooting people. not to ask. Remember that one clerk, Emily? She found a badge one of them had dropped and went down to return it? Never saw her again. You guys have a very nice workplace. Computer. Oh, hack. Oh, I can actually hack this? Let's go. I have just enough to do it. You stop that. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, the, 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 the lady's running. The lady's running over to stop me. Uh, from Caroline Endicott. What a cool name. Issue. Finally taking action. Theodore Isaacs keeps eating my purple berry lunch. <laughs> I know that sprat tooth little snot is the one doing it. I seen him with those cracker crumbs on his lips and those purple berry stains on his lab coat, working next to him and seeing him pick the remains of my lunch out of his disgusting teeth just makes me want to fucking scream! There, I did it. I screamed a little. That felt good. I'm just gonna go sit in the kitchen and wait for him to do it again. I'll catch him in the act, and then I'll come back and write up another entry. I am going to be so livid. What do you think you're doing? I don't know. I'm, I'm not. I'm not. No. <laughs> attack? <laughs> I don't want to fucking I don't want to attack, but I also don't want to give the 1500 bits. <laughs> okay, reminder close the door before you, you hack somebody's computer. <laughs> I, I'm not even. I can't even say nothing at all. <laughs> I thought I thought she was going to attack me. She's pissed off at me. He's like, I'm gonna fucking get you, and then starts crying and running away. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm I'm dead, dude. This game's fucking with me. Like, this, this game has to be fucking messing with me, right? <laughs> I'll show you. There's fucking nothing here. Oh, okay, wait, right. Okay, yeah, I was here just a second ago. I should have just used the elevator. God, I'm an idiot. It's hard to, it's hard to see things when there's so much visual clutter in my, in my eyes. Like, look, just... It's fucking the contrast, dude. Like, the, there's no cohesive design here. It's like somebody wanted to emulate something that looks nice by making something that. You know, uh, it's just a failed attempt. I don't know. I don't know what to say to it. It's just this the space detector is really fucking with me. Plus, like, the, the, the buttress, these fucking divots of the roof. Ugh. It's, like, it's like I'm on the inside of a, like a, a, a Minecraft golf ball. You guys look professional enough to blend in. Huh? Maybe maybe I'm the one standing out. Maybe if I just wore nicer clothes into this office space, I could have not been accosted by these friendly people. Okay, the scientists are probably not going to fuck with me, right? I really hope that they don't. Nobody better fuck with me. You good? You don't mind if I use your terminal, do you? Look at your lab notes. Try replicating the work Dr. Wells initially did on the, uh, the revivifying formula, but his notes are basically unintelligible. This may take a few iterations. Trial 64. Oh. oh. Burp came out of nowhere. I apologize. That's tetraborate ethanol, not toasted dinner roll. Maybe it is toasted dinner roll. How is that be your demanding results? I've submitted my catalog of dead sprats. What the fuck are they doing? I didn't realize it was possible to run out of sprats. Which genius left a new shipment of sprats at the kitchen? Still attempting to complete Wells' formula. Still going through a dozen sprats a week. We got a lot of work 
ahead of us if this is ever going to be effective at reviving people from long-term hibernation. Hey, well, I'm I'm here, bro. So they're just working on what like Phineas is working on. Maybe that's the angle if you like help the board. It's just like, well, they're both kind of kind of working on the same thing. Hi, cow. Oh, there's fucking cow poop here. Why did I open that? Why, why did I? Why was my first instinct to walk into the pile of poopy? <sighs> I'm messed up. I I must be. There must be something wrong with me. Oh, the morgue. Yeah, I've been in here a lot over the last couple Let years. The show that subject 23K's cause of death is cerebral vascular incident brought about by a ruptured aneurysm. That's an 86 percent failure rate for this batch. I think we can safely move on to the next. And I had such high hopes for this one. Oh well. I suppose it could have been worse. Yeah. They could have ended up like those poor bastards in containment. Hey guys. You're just hanging around with a shotgun. I hope you don't mind if I use your computer. Alright. Uh, autops autopsy records. Note. All subjects have perished under un undergoing multiple hibernation cycles. Oh, like frozen, unfrozen? Ugh. 19F. Massive cranial hemorrhage upon removal from the hibernation chamber. Yikes. Intestinal rupture? Lab tech, lab tech accidentally shorted the hibernation chamber. That's rough. Pulmonary edema upon removal. Just damn! Things are bad. These tests aren't going well. You guys need to do a better job. See, it, it, they're just doing the same thing that... Oh, hey. Hope you don't mind. I shoot at everything that moves, so you better just fucking stay still. Oh, don't kill any fucking scientists, dude. Don't do it. Is that it? Oh, that's not it. That's it. Only you can protect fourth quarter profits. Only I can. Plasma. There's nothing in here. Why is this a room? What am I? Oh right, there. There's a bunch of rooms here because you're supposed to fucking sneak around like a solid snake. But here I am, doing everything I can. Holding on to what I am. Fucking shooting everyone in space. Um. You know, I had I had a strict rule of like not. Fucking like stealing earlier on this on this playthrough, but we, we, fuck it, we have completely succumbed to the dark side. I guess that's just what a what a couple weeks in space will do to a do to a gal. It'll make you thirst for violence, and rivers of blood will flow. Endlessly into open graves. Uh, and a lot of bathrooms too. I, where am I going? I just want, I just want the chemicals. I just want the chemicals. I'm so, I'm so turned around. This is reminding me a lot of like me playing uh, Link's Awakening because <laughs> I got very lost and turned around in that one too. Animal testing. That's bad. You're not supposed to do that. Oh wait, I was I was already here. What what Oh, ooh, I'm so lost. Oh god. Here. Okay, yes, this looks different. Okay. Oh thank god. Oh, oh. It's nothing. It's nothing. It's it's nothing, I swear. It's nothing. It's nothing. It was just thin air. There's another elevator. Is this where I started? I... Where the fuck am I? Is this where I started? This... What? <laughs> I'm so close. I'm sad. Maybe I go up. Maybe going up will help me in this situation. Oh. Oh. 
Oh. Oh. What you get? I didn't mean it. Oh, God. Can't we just talk about this over a fucking coffee? We could have been friends, all of us. Maybe I should have done a board playthrough. You know, re really just simped for the board. It's been all about bureaucracy and stability. Hacking skill too low. I can't even see the cool stuff. Stop! Stop shooting in a fucking enclosed place. There's only so much oxygen for us to breathe out here. And we're wasting it on gunpowder explosions. Is there anything interesting in these... Uh, jail cells? Sealed. Give a name? Frenzy te Frenzy to test subject. Fre oh, that's not good. Still fighting over there? Borst. Borst soup. Borst surprise. Borst beans. Beans of borst. God. What are they going to have on weekends? <laughs> beans and beans and then borst and borst on Sunday? I hope combat's over. I'm so sick of the least interesting part of the game. Oh. I hate shooting ambulances. Employer rights under the biased, la <laughs> biased labor standards act. It's it's just it just fucking bonking you on the head, guys. It's just an ambulance. Quit shooting at those. Pe th th those, I know they heal the people that shoot us, but they also heal, heal like, you know, people that need to be healed. Wage determined by merit of your work, but who determines the merit of your work? Overtime may result in higher pay if the quality of said work is considered exemplary. Your employer has the right to dock your pay should you damage any facilities or equipment. It is your responsibility, not your employer's, to avoid workplace hazards. God, it just sounds like, uh... My job. <laughs> it sounds like current work environment. <laughs> when at first you don't succeed, log your results and notify your supervisor. LTHE. Uh, tests are ongoing, but so far we've had little success in adjusting the hibernation process to safely allow long term subject storage and revival. I'm not learning anything interest. I just, I just, it's just re establishing that nothing is going well. Like, I, I'm, I know that already. The whole point the whole point of this game is that nothing is going well. Fucking hurts my head that you have to hear it a million times. <laughs> oh, but just in case I forgot everybody was living in fucking space poverty and pseudo space fucking riches. Unbar that. You know, they fucking are just freezing the ab absolute shit out of people over here. I think they're all gonna die. How do I fucking do this? Oh, computer. I guess I need to uh, repair my weapons as well. Bonk. Yes. View lab notes. The addition of dimethyl sulfoxide to the current round of tests has resulted in some improvements. Subjects are showing improved circulation and increased neural activity. However, our formula is still missing something. We are unable to fully revive subjects from long-term hibernation. And removing their supply of dimethyl sulfoxide results in their rather excruciating death. The problem is compounded when we consider reviving and freezing subjects multiple times over their lives. To make matters worse, we've had a hard time securing additional... Okay. Well... Hmm. Reducing the dimethyl sulfoxide concentration to zero will result in the cancellation of the experiment. Exper oh, experimental integrity and tests uh, can be maintained by leaving 70... No, we can't leave 73% of this shit behind. All of it. 
Fuck, fuck these people. <laughs> Janine McSpacer is tired of taking the humanitarian route. I already feel bad. Felix or Ellie wasn't fucked up that I did that. Something on your mind? A lot. There's always a lot on my mind. It's nice to know that like the 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 McGuffin was just in a big jar. Return to Phineas. That's it. We just go. We just go back now. That's it. Here's what I can't get over. Clyde wasn't always friendly. He wasn't ever polite, but he was always on a level. You always knew where he stood. Now I don't know what to think. I don't know if he was ever straight with me. Did he ever believe in fighting the board, or was he just feeding me a story? Don't take it personally. Most people aren't even honest with themselves. It gets easier when you remember that. I guess it don't matter now. Clyde's gone, and it's time I moved on. It's nice to finally hear you talk about your fucking uh, inner turmoil, Felix, because... Because damn, dude, the way you ended those quest lines was fucking dry as shit. But now, but now that you're talking about it with Ellie, you know, that's good. Why don't you tell me how you feel? Don't you trust me? I'm your captain. Wow, so fucking, uh... So I guess we stormed the castle to... To get the cool stuff. You might not want to go in there uh, ever again. Because uh, everybody's dead. So, like, super dead. Is that really, like, journal, that's it? Return to Phineas? Oh, to plan my next move? Okay, like, fuck this place. As long as we don't go back here. I'm so, I'm so sick of killing people. I'm so sick of it. I never wanted. I can't. Who are the hostiles? Are these the hostiles? They're they they're, they they could barely fucking. They're, they 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 run away from me. If they run away from me, they can't be considered hostiles. They're more like, they're just just innocents. Let me fast travel. <laughs> Fuck's sake. I want to go back to my ship, and I'm on the opposite side of the city. It feels like I'm like being I'm taking the walk of shame past all these people that hate me. Except these only on pictures fans. They probably see me in that new flick already and are very impressed with my work. I fucking hate this place. I'm just I'm just taking a few small breaths to myself to really collect the fact that I ho I don't think I'm coming back because I fucking hate it. I hate it here. I hate the snootiness. I hate. I just hate. I hate the way everybody talks. It it it, it honestly gives me a headache. Oh, for a second I thought I saw like Patrick Star from SpongeBob's face here. Like the, I, I'm tracing it with my cursor, but like right here, the the way the light's curving on the bottom part of the bell. And the way the light shining off the middle knob. I thought it was like eyes and stuff. So it was like top of a triangle. And then for a second I thought it was pink. So I thought that looked like Patrick Star. I'm fucking crazy. Well, it was nice visiting Byzantium. I, I missed those two shots point blank with a shotgun. I'm... I am bad. You know, I figure we we already killed every other guard in the city. Might as well just f finish them off. It gives it gives some other people a chance at a job, maybe when they have to refill their ranks. Let's just go fucking see Phineas. <laughs> like we've, I I'm so done with being on the dark side. I wanted to be nice. I wanted to be nice. I wanted to be nice so bad. Crew members Ellie and Max are engaged. Heated discussion. In the kitchen. 
Oh, let me get up there. Max. Maximilian. Vicar. Don't. Vicky. Yes. Aw, oh, this is no fun anymore. Quit trying to pick on uh, Mr. Max, Maximilian DeSoto. He's 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 an all right guy after he smoked that weed. Oh, my knees! All right, come on. Let's just. I uh, I'm my brain hurt. Minister Clark is lucky to have you on his. Minister Clark is lucky to be alive, Ada. He's lucky I don't fucking dome him because the 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 longer genemic spacer stays in space, the more people are going to die. I want to go home to Earth already, for fuck's sake. Taking these two with me, Pr Pravati is not allowed to leave the house. <laughs> we took all the gas, we killed all those people. I... I feel bad. I feel bad. No, I don't. Janine feels nothing anymore. I've kept myself busy in your absence. Optimized my formula. I'm now confident I can revive the remaining colonists. Like how confident? All I need now is the dimethyl sulfoxide. I'll take as much as you can give me. I found your uh, chemicals in the ministry. The board was testing them on the human subjects. But that's what they kind of like excuse, uh, uh, accuse you of doing. I had uh, unfortunately I I did have to let them die. It was a rough sight to see, but I, I brought you all the chemicals you asked for. Thank you. You've brought me enough chemicals to get started at least. I'm just sorry they came at the cost of human lives. Like like an entire room people, full of them. Yeah, they did. They died in excruciating agony. It was terrible. Uh, what was trying to well, you know how food goes stale if you freeze it too much. It's kind of like that, but with people. You say the board's trying to freeze their subjects over and over again without inflicting permanent damage. Well, they're nowhere close to solving that problem. Something about this feels wrong. I don't know why the board would ever conduct such an experiment unless they're working on some kind of hibernation technology. I'll tell you this much. The board scientists are hopelessly lost. After years of fruitless experimentation, they've made exactly... Isn't that also kind of like you, Mr. Wells? Well, shoot. Uh, this this whole colony's on the verge of collapse. The, birds, the board's been trying to cover it up. I know. I've suspected as much for years. Of course, I don't expect the board to do a thing about it. They're actually planning on putting everybody in a cryo tube. The board's mismanagement put our colony on the road to collapse. If we don't put a stop to them, thousands of colonists are going to die. Oh no, thousands of colonists. It's not like I've been killing hundreds. Oh yeah, the 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 GM, yeah, it gets worse. That is literally the the official plan. I was I was kind of uh, surprised too. Never imagined we were already there. The board made this crisis, and now they want to solve it by freezing the rest of us. That's not a plan. That's a goddamn escape clause. Do you realize what this means for the hope for your fellow colonists? The board's going to kill them all, toss them out into space. Just to make room in their hibernation chambers. Yep. It ain't sound good. Oh. Well, we gotta think hard hard and hard about this. There's gotta be some we got it we can do. Short of lining up every member of the board and shooting them in the Shit, at this rate, I'd be willing to do it. Earth ever sent us uncorrupted by the board. 
So what you're saying, is the, the hope, so there's hope on the hope. I get it. Like right now, right now. Before the board, I have enough chemicals to start reviving a few of them, but no easy way to get them off the hope. It would have been easier if he just fucking well, parked right up next to the dang thing. Merciful gibbering law, you're a genius. Of course I am. We bring the hope to us. Skip the entire ship across the distance of colony space, right next to my land. Wouldn't they be able to track that ship though? Well, walk me through it. If we link up the hope to the unreliable, then use your navigational computer to calculate a reasonably safe vector, we can skip the entire colony ship into the rings of Terra 2. I've got a healthy disregard for personal safety, but this sounds crazy, even to me. Your instincts are correct. By any reasonable definition of sanity, this plan is crazy. Isn't it wonderful? I don't understand a word you said, Doc. All I know is, if we're gonna hijack a colony ship, count me in. Yes, excellent. I approve of your enthusiasm, young man. You should ask your captain for a raise. You'll need to switch on the Hope's auxiliary. I'll give you one. Unreliable. Then, head to the bridge. Your navigational computer, Ada, should be able to activate the Hope's skip drive. Once you've skipped the Hope next to my lab, access to the frozen colonists. I can start reviving them immediately. I'll do it. I don't I don't got any fucking questions. It that seems pretty straightforward. The hope is caring some of humanity's most brilliant thinkers. Yes, I fucking know. You you've repeated the fact that there are scientists, engineers, artists on this fucking ship many times. Maybe like eight. I know, or I get it. Us believe Halcyon is beyond saving. I choose to believe otherwise. If there's even the slightest chance we can save Halcyon from oblivion, then we have to take it. I want to talk about the hope. Certainly. How can I help? Is it something is, is there Is there going to be any resistance on that ship? Are people going to notice a, a, a huge colony ship slamming into the rings of Terra 2? Unlikely. The hope is as massive as the Groundbreaker, but compared to the rings of Terra 2, positively minuscule. The board might notice, possibly, depending on the position of their heads relative to the depth of their collective posteriors. Do you mean their butts? Uh, that's all I need to know. Oh, and another, and another level up. Great. We're getting, yeah, like straight up like a level up per episode. Great. Cool. We're getting so close to the other game. <laughs> ah. Well, you know what? I think this is a good time to cut it. Oh. I need a break. Just, I'm so sick of fucking just clicking people on the head and watching people scream. I didn't want to be a bad person. I didn't want to be a bad person. Oh, I didn't want to be a bad person. But here we are, we're fucking the worst people I've ever met. But I already knew that when I woke up and looked into the mirror this morning. <sighs> so I guess next time we go onto the Hope. Fucking try and uh, save some people. I think that's what the plan is. Let, let's let's read, read the thing. That's it. Yeah, just go to Terra 2, land your ship on the Hope Stock. Great, cool. Fucking thanks. Co incredibly straightforward. Thanks for watching. I hope I hope we kill less people in the next one. But if I remember if from what I do remember of the end of the game there's going to be a lot of running and a lot of gunning and at least we're going to look amazing doing it. Like forget forget I'm just put, uh, should I just put on the fucking clothes? They look so good. It's hard, it's hard to just commit to a look. Ah, fucking, I'm rambling off to myself. I'm gonna see you guys later.